Welcome to Brayon Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have these two triangles uh, laid down side by side and uh, the length of the given segments are as follows. So AE is 6, EC is uh, uh, 14, and DE is 13, and CD is 15, and BC is 5. And we are required to find the area of this uh, blue triangle. Okay, so first thing that we may do is uh, we can actually draw a line that is perpendicular to this uh, segment EC from uh, point D. Okay. And next is we draw a line from C. We continue this uh, from C, this segment EC. And from point B, a line also perpendicular to the extended EC. Okay. Okay, so next, later, we will compare these two right triangles, uh, FDC and this uh, BCG. And we'll get simply this uh, height, uh, this length BG, and multiply this uh, to the base of the triangle uh, AC. So we get the reference as the base. So therefore, we'll get the area later. Okay, so for now, we will compare these two right triangles, uh, EFD and uh, FDC. So they have the same height, so FD. So uh, let's call this as H, this FD. And the respective hypotenuse are 13 and 15. So next is we call this EF as X. And this uh, uh, FC is uh, 14 minus X because 14 is the total. Okay, so next is we equate the two uh, right triangles because they have the same height. So H square is equal to H square. So 13 squared minus x squared is equal to if you focus on efd is equal to the height of this uh, which is a uh, uh, 15 square minus uh, 14 minus x squared a uh, 15 square sorry 15 square so this gives us a uh, 169 minus uh, x square we just need to copy is equal to 225 minus uh, 14 times 14 gives you 196 so 196 minus 28x plus x square so we just need to copy this on the left hand side 169 minus x square is equal to 225 minus 196 plus 28x then uh, minus x square and we can cancel this negative x square and negative x square and we are left with the 169 okay so minus 225 plus 196 is equal to 28x so this gives you 140 so let's interchange the left and the right so this gives you 140 so 140 is equal to 28x and if we divide both sides by 28 so this gives us x is equal to 5 units okay so next is we get the value of h so h is equal to uh, we can use either of the two uh, uh, tri triangles but we will use this uh, triangle the smaller EFD, so h square is equal to the square root of uh, 13 square minus uh, uh, x square, yeah, but x is 5, so this gives us a uh, 100, uh, six, uh, 13 times 13 is 169 minus 5 square or 25, uh, 5 square, so h square is equal to 169 minus 25 gives us a I, this is, should not be squared so let's delete this so this gives us h is equal to square root of 144 or h is equal to 12 units
Okay, so next is we consider these two right triangles FCD and this triangle BCG. And we notice that they have the, both of them an angle that is vertic two, a pair of vertical angles. So let's call this alpha and alpha. And if one of the angles of those right triangles is alpha, the other is the complement. So we can say that this is the complement. We call it beta and this is beta. And having these two triangles have three equal or congruent at angles, then these two triangles are similar by triple A, I mean similarity theorem. So these two triangles are similar. Okay, so next is we use uh, uh, the ratio of uh, for angle beta uh, adjacent over hypotenuse. So for triangle uh, uh, FCD, so FCD, so we have this uh, adjacent to be H over the hypotenuse, which is 15. And for the other is BCG. Uh, let's call this uh, BG to be Y. So Y, that is the adjacent to beta for Y. I for the triangle BCG, the adjacent to beta for the triangle BCG is Y. So Y over 5. So, but H is 12 over 15. So we just copy. So Y over 5. So Y is equal to, we can reduce this into 3. So uh, Y becomes 12 times uh, over 3. So this gives you 4. So 4 units. Okay, so now for the final step, so the area of uh, triangle ABC, ABC is equal to one half times uh, the base, which is a uh, AC, times the height, which is a uh, BG. Okay, so copy this is equal to one half times AC, which is a uh, six plus fourteen. Then BG is equal to Y. So this is Y. So but Y is actually a 4 as we have got earlier. So 4 divided by 2 is 2. So this becomes 20. So we just multiply this. 20 times 2 gives us area of triangle ABC is equal to 40 square units. And that is our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you liked our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.